What's up, Code Breakers? Welcome back to another episode. We we're just back from the gym and the hardware store. We're gonna take advantage of the mild day and try our luck at this windshield repair kit on Eddie before that rock chip spreads further. Mm. And every time we go to a certain Canadian store, Brian has to check out what knives are on sale. Which means Canadian Tire. It was $4.99. It was on sale for $4.99. I should have bought 10 of them. <laughs> it's camo. We're going to lose it and not be able to find it. We lose them all, to be honest. Anyway, <laughs> stick around. Today's lesson is brought to you by the word irony. Oh, you found an old knife to open the new knife. Where'd you find that knife? It looks pretty dirty. It was in the knife drawer where all the other <laughs> knives are in the toolbox. <laughs> we have a knife drawer in the toolbox because of this hobby. Well, this knife is going to go in the console of Eddie. Come on, it was $5. Lock shut. Brand outbound. Get it at Canadian Tire while supplies last. <laughs> there were four there? Yeah. I almost bought them all. All right. Here we go. <laughs> wow. I want to make... Okay. Oh. That's threaded, that's threaded. I can see where we're going with this. Good for one or two rock chips, you think? Hopefully two. <laughs> okay. Oh, something fell out. Oh. Uh, this is apparently a razor blade. I don't know what these are yet. Probably shouldn't have got them dirty though. Oh. <laughs> Ugh. Pressure driver. I, oh. Clean area with dry towel. Noted. Center ring over impact point. This ring? Yep. Oh, okay, so the chip goes there. Okay. Remove loose that grass with the glass with the razor blade. Scraping with the razor blade. I see. And then this is going to go like. All right, let's go give it a whirl. Crocs no socks. Crocs no socks. Oh yeah, there's the wind. Oh, there's the rooster. Somebody's crowing over there. Alright, well, there it is. Step one is to take the suction cup mount and center the rock chip right there because this thing is, is a little rubber doodad on the top so that's going to apply pressure so you screw that right down to the crack three four dabs of resin and then this is like the the driver thing that's supposed to penetrate that crack when you're done it comes with these things too you can put more resin on here and, and then just put it on like that and scrape it off with a razor blade after about 10 minutes so let's see if it works
that looks center? That looks center to you? Center enough? Depends on your angle, you know? Straight on? I think that's pretty good. Alright. I think we're we're locked and, and loaded. What do you think? What do you think? The irony. Steph makes fun of me. I need a knife. no idea if this is working or what I'm doing but it says to repeat what we just did two or three times to get all the air out of it so it's creating like a backwards suction vacuum and trying to inject resin into the, the void of the glass Also, thank you, Ryan, former student of mine and viewer of the channel for the suggestion. Loved your comment the other day. Appreciate the feedback. Keep them coming. A little bit nervous about this step, but it says a little bit of heat. A little bit of heat. Oh, that's a lot of bit of heat. I think the chip itself is full. We use these clear things now as like a band-aid over the cracks. And then it says, let it sit out in the sun for 10 minutes. So the sun is perfect spot in the sky.
Well, the instruction said it would help minimize it, but definitely present, prevent, present, prevent it from spreading. So I can, I can live with seeing it for $16 as long as it doesn't get any worse. This kit was only $16. So it says to leave the little bandage doodad here on for about five or 10 minutes in the sun and then take a razor blade and get all the excess off. So here's hoping. And while we're at it, yep, might as well. Might as well. What do you think? While we're waiting, while we're waiting, Gotta do a big shout out to our friends and supporters of the channel. Thank you for making this all possible. If you want your name featured on the Asphalt Wall of Fame, simply buy some coffee or even a beer. Help support the gas fund. Links in the description below. Okay. Whew. Well, it's dry to the touch. It's dry to the touch. Uh, the parts that, well, maybe not. Maybe not. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Dry to the touch. Time for the razor blade. So it said it would minimize it. I don't know how much it actually has minimized the rock chip itself, but it's certainly, it's certainly smooth. It's certainly smooth to the touch. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. That is remarkable. And voila. Amazing. Well, I can't feel it. I can still see it, but I can't feel it. Can you even hear me with this wind? Every time I get the camera out, the wind comes up. Yeah. That's great. That's great. Well, 
I'd say that's a success for $16.99 versus, well, that's a custom piece of glass. They don't make them like rounded like that anymore. That's going to do it for another episode. Peace and love from Canada's most southern mainland and shoreline. Give somebody close to you a hug. Tell them they matter. Don't forget, you matter. Cheers. Get your official merch at mistrasmall.com slash store.